As NASA looks to embrace longer missions that send astronauts deeper into the vestiges of space, there are a number of complex and highly technical issues to deal with, and some very basic ones like using the bathroom. Pressurized spacecraft offer a bathroom, but if tasked with a longer spacewalk or a situation arises where stuff hits the fan and a spacesuit needs to be worn for days at a time, waste disposal becomes vital in preserving an astronaut's health. Well, NASA answered this call of nature in the form of their Space Poop Challenge. Hosted by crowdsourcing platform HeroX, more than 5,000 solutions were submitted from every country and continent on the planet. The challenge sought solutions for a suit's waste management system, needing to account for up to six days of continuous use. It also had to work quickly in microgravity without impeding movement and for both men and women and for numbers one and two. The winner of the Space Poop Challenge was Thatcher Corden, a family physician, Air Force officer, and flight surgeon whose Macy's perineal access and toileting system took its inspiration from Corden's surgical experience. Paraphrasing the inventor, he felt that if something as delicate as heart valves could be replaced through catheters in an artery, a similar approach could be used to handle a little bit of poop. He also, to the relief of space travelers everywhere, didn't want to keep anything inside the suit any longer than necessary. Cardin designed a small airlock in the crotch of the suit where items like inflatable bedpans could be passed through, expanded, and removed. Sort of a catch and release type of thing. The design would even allow for changing one's underwear while inside the spacesuit. Cardin was awarded $15,000 for his efforts. The next step for NASA is a working prototype that will be tested for the International Space Station. I'm Jeff Ranke and this is I Am Now. Space Poop Challenge.